Hello guys, so had the worst, one of the worst weeks I could have. Uh, so now to cheer me up, I am going to record this video and show you something I did on the Arduino, um, which I'm planning for my Honda Civic. Um, so yeah, let's just get started. Um, I'm going to show you a bit, a bit how to get started with Arduino. Um, Maybe you can do some cool projects uh, for your car, electronic stuff and lights. You can have sound, um, sensors, switches. I mean, you can do all kind of stuff with this thing. Um, so, what you want to do is go to Arduino on Google or um, your web search engine, and then you get to the Arduino. Home page, you press home, uh, software, software downloads. Um, there's this thing, and then there's the Arduino actual download IDE. You get the one that you are using. I am using Windows 7 at the moment, so I get the Windows installer for XP and up. And when you download it, you just press next, next, and all the stuff. Then you go to start, then you have Arduino, you just basically press on it and it opens the Arduino Genuino or Arduino Uno. It says here there is a new version, um, not actually right now, so alright, that's basically what, what you do. And then you go to tools, up here press on it and then you press you select the board mine is an Arduino Uno Genuino Uno um, you can buy these on eBay you can buy these anywhere um, as for the port at the moment the uh, Arduino is not connected so I'll connect that up right away and what you, want, you would want to do is find the USB port Connect this um, this USB cable usually supplied with the Arduino. Um, as you can see, I have a breadboard with two Arduinos. Um, so yeah, and uh, as soon as you connect the board, you should go out here, tools, and you see the the port. If you don't see it, you just go to port and select it from here. But it, if it shows very good. Then it's on communication for. Alright, we exit that, we exit this, and we go to this project, which I am um, currently working on. Um, it's just basically, I just use the fade example and I um, modified some of the, uh, the values, and basically. Made the LED do what I like to do. So now I upload the, um, the code, it compiles, then it uploads to the board, loading, uploading done, and then we go to the port. I press the reset button and uh, can't stop looking at that thing, just fading up yeah so that is something to cheer me up guys i know it doesn't really make sense to anybody who doesn't um understand electronics or um cars or whatever or doesn't but um for the 15 subscribers that i have um, I just want you to know that I'm constantly thinking of uh, of you of doing some other videos and basically this is what I'm working on at the moment hopefully when I finish the project it will look nice on my Honda Civic V3 um, and hopefully it's gonna be awesome um, so I'm just going to play with this on a Friday night 
Um, that's five minutes past, and I see you on the next next video. So that's how to get started on the Arduino. It's very simple, very easy. Um, just a tip: go to File, go to Examples, and basically here you'll find all the examples. And if you go to uh, YouTube or online f uh, forums, you'll see a lot of stuff. Um, this is basically, for example, some analog pins, um, digital buttons. Yeah, it has all kinds of stuff. Basics. Then you go to, for example, uh, digital read or blink, like blinking an LED fade, the one I'm using at the moment. Um, you can have USB string, and there's all kinds of stuff. Um, so yeah, that's something to cheer me up. Um, and to give you guys an idea what I'm working at the moment, um, on the car I already have some work done. Um, I have a mirror which is which I need to fix back now. Um, so yeah, stay tuned. Please subscribe and like my page. Um, I have like 99 likes on that page. If you could all subscribe to my channel, I would really, I would really like uh, like your like and your subscribe your subscription. And yeah, so alright. So hello again and bye bye.